Um, I wanted to ask for an update on the missing F-35 uh, that's now been found. What exactly happened that caused the pilot to eject himself? Uh, where does the no-fly order stand now? What does all this mean in terms of our broader um, national security and things like that? Sure. Uh, so as it, as it relates to the F-35, uh, as, you, as you're aware, the Marine Corps is currently investigating that. So it would be inappropriate for me to, to provide any comment while they conduct their investigation. Um, we have no doubt that it will be a thorough investigation, and when there's information to share, they will. Um, and s similarly, for the, the stand down that the uh, Marine Corps, the acting commandant of the Marine Corps initiated, I'd refer you to the Marine Corps to talk about that. Um, it's important to take a step back, you know, as far as national security goes. It, it's always unfortunate anytime we lose an aircraft. In this case, we're very thankful that the pilot was okay. Um, but broadly speaking, uh, we're confident that we can continue to defend the nation and do what we need to do. I understand you said the investigation is still ongoing with the Marines, but there's a lot of questions surrounding this and a lot of headlines right now. Is there anything that you can share to people that are wondering what happened here? Well, that's exactly what the investigation will tell us, and that's why it's important that we not jump to conclusions, that we not speculate, that we don't allow our imagination to fill gaps. And we have a very methodical, very deliberate, very uh, tried and true process that will take a look at exactly what the situation was. Uh, get the facts, and then, as appropriate, apply those facts to prevent these kinds of things from happening again. Thank you very much.